Hello YouTube, welcome back to another video and in today's video we're doing what if Hinata gave Naruto her Byakugan. So let's get into it. Wait, oh wait, nigga. Alright, so let's get into the what if. Now, this is part three, obviously, of what if he not to give Naruto her Byakugan. So, I believe we last left off with um, Naruto and then confronting the death about Hiruzen and everything else. Now, we want, we're going to pick up with um, Jiraiya approaching Naruto. This is about like a couple, um, like two weeks later. So, Jiraiya approaches Naruto and, t and tells him that he wants him to come on a mission. And he will just be straight up honest with Naruto to find the next Hokage. It's Naruto will say, but we just recently lost Hokage. It's not Jay will then tell Naruto to snap out of it. So you would tell him that if a Hokage dies, then in, um, the village should have a Hokage right away. It should always be a backup Hokage in case the Hokage dies. As Jiraiya then explains to Naruto about Donzo, saying that Donzo will try if Donzo becomes Hokage, if we don't find this new Hokage, and Donzo becomes the Hokage, the Hidden Leaf will never be the same. It won't be the way the old man wanted it to be. It won't, there won't be any peace between the elemental nations. A dream of his own. And Nar as he would then tell Naruto that Donzo will basically make everyone and slaves and everything but name. That they will um that he will make sure that all you know we have no emotions. Then if any um began to show anything, like began to show an ounce of betrayal to the village, even if they're not betraying the village, he will have him executed. Naruto will get up and say, "Fine, let's go." Because Naruto's already lost two people, this being Kirizen and Hinata. As Naruto looks at his jacket, as he then pulls out a necklace that he had made um, after, um, during the finals. Naruto opens it as, this, as the picture is in there. He says, you'll always be with me, Hinata. As he puts the picture back in. I know that's a little bit girly, I believe. I'm not sure. I haven't, I haven't seen a man with one, so I'm just going to assume. Anyways... Jiraiya and Naruto would depart from the Hidden Leaf Village and would go out to different towns. When they would come across, well, after two days, they would come across a town called Tanazuka Town. Tanazuka Town. Now, if I, my memory serves me correctly, when they were here, um, people, well, they would hear and see people running away, so there's a giant snake attacking the castle. So Naruto and Jiraiya knotted each other and will both run towards where this giant snake is so called at. This so called giant snake is at. And when they would arrive, they would see a broken down, well, like a really destroyed wall. And, well, Jiraiya will say, This is definitely the work of Tsunade. As Nar Jiraiya says, Naruto, do you sense that? As Naruto activates his reacting on this, Naruto says, Yeah. They're pretty far away. How can you see so far already? It's nonsense. Says, I don't know. <clears throat> Anyways, believe they're here for you. Do you remember the story I told you on our way here about the Akatsuki? Ah, uh, so they're they're two members. Uh, they're two. They're the members of the, this organization, aren't they? Yes. You must stay with me no matter what. Naruto will nod. As um, Naruto and Jiraiya will go searching around later that night. As Jiraiya and Naruto will then run into go into a bar after getting very tired and hungry. As when they will walk in, Jiraiya will look around and he would then spot a a blonde haired shinobi well a blonde haired woman with a diamond on her forehead with ample amount of titties I mean ample amount I'm so sorry for that <laughs> uh, and well he would then you know Tsunade 
And so now that we get up and say Jiraiya, she then says, "Who? What are you doing here?" Naruto's jaws would drop as he would lean towards Pervy's as boy towards Jiraiya. Says, "She is beautiful, Jiraiya." Jiraiya says, "I told you." Anyways, <clears throat> may we sit, Tsunade? And Tsunade says, "Fine." <clears throat> As Naruto and Jiraiya would then go and sit down in Tsunade's booth. As Jiraiya, as Tsunade and Jiraiya would begin to play, I believe it was poker or some card game. As Tsunade would then ask, what is it that he wants? As Jiraiya would then tell Tsunade that the village wants her to become the fifth Hokage. I don't, I, for some reason, I was just about to say the second, but the fifth Hokage. And this is when things will all go downhill. This is when um, Tsunade will begin to say something about, um, well, you know, the Hokage is basically disrespecting all of them, even the third Hokage. But something truly unexpected would happen. As Naruto will begin to radiate the Kaiyubi's chakra, she says, say that again. I want you to. As Naruto is legit just unleashing the Kaiyubi's full force of killing intent. Causing, like, I don't even think, even Jiraiya, Tsunade, no one could truly stand up to the Kaiyubi's killing intent. Let's be honest. Unless you're like another Genturiki who's handled their Biju's killing intent. No, Itachi and Kisame will feel this intent, but you know, them being the fucking, the fucking walking W's they are. Will walk in and will begin to attack. As Tsunade um, and Suzune will jump back, as Jiraiya says, Itachi, Kisame. So you were the two they sent, huh? You were, two, you were the two members of the Akatsuki they sent after Naruto. As Itachi says, ah, Jiraiya. So I guess it was you that who told Kakashi about us. Well, I hope you enjoy the fact that you won't be living leaving here alive. <laughs> yeah. It doesn't matter to me. How about we start this little fight? As Sonate um as Sonate would then say Wait. What is the kid's name? I feel like I've heard his name somewhere. Excuse me, what did he say his name was? Um, Itachi Uchiha? No. Kisame Hoshigaki? No, the blonde kid. Naruto Uzumaki. And Sinana was too drunk to realize. But this, this, this is her godson. Or, well, this yes, I'm gonna have to change. I'm changing the story up a bit. This is her godson. The one Kushina... Um, Kushina's child. <laughs> As Tsunade says, Shizune, help them out. I cannot allow them to hurt Naruto. Tsunade-sama, why not? He's the only piece of family I have left. But I thought... Is he a senju? No. <clears throat> he's a Nuzumaki like me. But he's also my godson. I cannot allow him to die. She'll say, right, Tsunade Sama. As Tsunade and, um, Tsunade would basically use a healing jutsu on herself to get rid of, you know, the effects of the alcohol, and would then jump into the fight. As Kisame says, Itachi, we must leave now. Even I know we don't stand a chance against two legendary Sami, especially at the strength we have now. You're right. We don't. Must retreat. As Itachi and Kisame are about to run away when they hear a voice, and then a thousand, the sound of a thousand birds chirping. As, as Sasuke then runs at Itachi screaming, Chidori! As he slams it directly into Itachi, Itachi begins to call for blood. He says, Good job, little brother. You snuck up on me. As Itachi would then begin to you know, 
A, cro a flock of crows would then come out of Itachi, separating his body, signifying that Itachi had put uh, Kakashi had put everyone under again due to the moment he walked in. I don't believe that's. I believe this is crow clone Jutsu. So I'm just gonna go um, say this again, Jutsu, for now on. It's not again, Jutsu. He, that he this was a clone. Itachi will reform behind Sasuke. He will kick Sasuke. And we then go on the attack of Sasuke. Kisame will then try to hold back and fight Tsunade, Shizune, Nar a pissed off Naruto who's using the Kiwi Chakra Jir and Jiraiya all at the same time. As Naruto and Jiraiya say, We've had enough of this. <clears throat> now, I don't I don't think I had Naruto learn this move. Oh, I did. As Jiraiya say, Hold your hand out, Naruto. Naruto will do it. He says, now pump as much chakra as much as you can. The max amount, but without passing out. It's Naruto will pump out a whole bunch of chakra. And as Jiraiya would then focus on the rotation of the chakra. And the, uh, the rotation and the, the condensing of the, uh, the, the rotation and the power of the Sengon. All those things. As Jiraiya and Naruto jump up into the sky, as Kisame holds us to Samihara, but Samihara has a limit. Well, it cannot absorb all of this chakra. Especially because this chakra is somewhat poisonous to it. Well, it is poisonous to it. It's the mix of human chakra with Biju chakra. This being Jiraiya's, along with Naruto's. And Jiraiya's chakra has residues of nature energy, something Samihara cannot absorb. And the Kyuubi's chakra. So it eventually become at his limit. Today, Naruto and Jiraiya would then scream, Rasengan! As they finally hit it into Kisame, effectively killing him. As he touches, he says, Look, Sasuke, your teammate is stronger than you, has a stronger sensei than you, and will always surpass you. You should be more like him. Have more hate. As he will then put... Sasuke under Genjutsu, well under Tsukuyomi, and with then depart, leaving behind Samehara. As Naruto will go, um, leaving behind Kisame's body in Samehara. So Naruto will go up to, ki uh, to try to run after Itachi, but will then stop when he sells that Itachi's gotten away. This is when Jiraiya is about to, um, Naruto will walk in on Jiraiya about to seal away Samihara when Naruto is then kicked straight in the face and sent into a wall. It's not so sad to spin, because he just sees a man in green, in a green spandex like Rock Lee. And Naruto begins to say, Lee, what did you do that for? He says, oh, N Naruto, I, I am not my youthful student, Lee. It is I, my guy. The least blue beast. Naruto says, what was that for? Oh, I thought you were an enemy. I'm so very sorry for that. As the QB begins to send chakra towards Naruto's head. As Naruto and um would get up as Naruto says, wait, Jiraiya. There's something about that sword. As Naruto will pick up Samehara. But Summon Hardy wouldn't attack it like it would someone who isn't worthy of its of itself. He says, What the hell? How can you pick up Summon Hada? And just says, I don't know, but I guess it likes me. As, you know, he tries to say, Alright, kid, keep it, but here, seal it away in a scroll. A sword isn't really your style, and it should only be used as a last resort. Last resort. I guess we should get you a different, another sword also, in case you choose to pick up Kenjutsu. Naruto says, um, okay. <clears throat> As Naruto... I'm sorry. Anyway, as Naruto and Jiraiya will then, um, walk away, um, begin to walk away, as Tsunade says, Naruto. So Naruto will turn around to see someone wrap their arms around. To see Tsunade is basically just hugged down. So Naruto says, what is this for? Tsunade says, I, you were supposed to be dead. How are you alive? As, you know, Jiraiya says, what are you talking about, Tsunade? Why would he be dead? 
Shinani says Donzo's it, um, has sent me a letter saying that Naruto had died when, from childbirth. Naruto was the real reason why I left the village all those years ago because I truly had no one else. Huh. Donzo said, huh? She said, so yes. Yes, he did. As, you know, Naruto would then say, Donzo said I was dead. And why do you care if I'm alive or not? Dry will say, kid, minions do not hear your godparents. As Naruto would then see nothing but red. As he would then punch Tsunade, but would not unconsciously be imbuing his hand in chakra, all most majority of his chakra that he has left. As he would then speed away towards um Jiraiya. Now Jiraiya just still, you know, shot at the fact that Naruto just punched Hello, oh, video just punched Tsunade. I don't even know. Get out of YouTube. He just um, punched Tsunade and sent her is flying somewhat. As Naruto would then punch the rice straight in the gut, sending this man straight up into the not into the sky but into the roof. His dryer would be stuck there. Naruto begins to scream at them, saying, How could you? How could you both abandon me? His dryer says, I didn't abandon you. I knew I couldn't raise a child, especially with me being a legendary Sani. I knew if I would have took you with me, people would have been after me. So I left you with Sir Toby. When he told me that he couldn't find Tsunade, and that Tsunade had sent him a letter about saying thank you for telling telling him that you were dead, or um to tell to tell Donzo thank you for telling her that you were dead, I would I went and spent most of my time searching for Tsunade. Because you deserve a family, Naruto. You deserve that at least. But Donzo took that away from you. So Naruto says, Donzo, you bastard. Sasuke um, is staring a little bit as Tsunade says, Wait, let me heal him now. And Tsunade begins to heal Sasuke. As a couple of hours later, Sonata would then clear God to take Sasuke away. Sasuke would then, but before then, Sasuke would then ask Naruto, "What's so special about you? How is he more special? How are you more special to his brother than he is?" He would then tell Naruto that they are no longer friends, and when he gets back to Konoha, he will fight him and he will lose. So now until this, Marisa says, "I can't wait, Sasuke." As Guy would go on ahead of everyone, taking Sasuke to the hospital for him to, you know, he was healed enough to leave, but not fully healed, for him to be healed a couple days earlier. So Tsunade would then, and now uh, Tsunade and uh, Jiraiya and Shizune and Naruto will all be spending in a couple days with Naruto getting to know Tsunade. As they were, um, a couple days later, they would head back to Konoha with Naruto having another necklace around his. One that he won in a poker game against Tsunade, along with millions of dollars that he's won in um, casinos. Luck of the devil, I guess. Or should I say the Nine Tails demon? The Nine Tails. As Naruto and Tsunade would, um, Naruto and Tsunade would have built somewhat of a you no, know, a grandmother and grandson type relationship. As Tsunade says, so, kid, you never told me why did you want to become Hokage? Well, if really it was because the villagers hated me, they they ostracized me, they beat me. No one wanted to acknowledge me. So I decided that, and they called me demon so many times, so I decided if I was to become Okage, I would show them that I was none of those things. I would prove them wrong about me. And it's been my dream to become Okage ever since, but ever since the old man died. I decided to become Okage to protect that which is precious to me. Something that the old man did. And that's why I want to become Okage now. 
Hmm. It's a good answer. Well, we'll just have to see if you grow strong enough to become Hokage. As Nanta says, I guess we'll just have to see. So, um, back arriving back at Konoha, Naruto would go to the hospital to check on Sasuke to see how when they're gonna fight. And Tsunade, um, Tsunade told Naruto not to fight Sasuke. That Sasuke is out of his mind. That he's not in the right state of his mind because the person who just killed his family, the man, the person that he's been hating his entire life, just showed up and told him that he wasn't as important as you were. The man he's been trying to kill this entire life didn't feel see him as important. He would then tell Naruto that not to fight Sasuke at all. But you know Naruto, he would not listen. So Naruto would arrive in the hospital and Sasuke would get out of bed and would say, Fight me, Naruto. Naruto says, Where? When and where? Tell me now. Sasuke would say, Now, on the roof. So Naruto would then say, I'll meet you up there. As Naruto disappears, Sasuke says, what is that? So my tongue, but, but, body, body flicker. How does Naruto know that Jitsu? Damn it. Sasuke will begin running to the roof. Is he saying Naruto? As Naruto will activate his Byakugan as he not to gaze him. Gaze him. As... That's obviously Sasuke. As Naruto would then unravel a uh, scroll. Uh, he, uh, he would grab the scroll, unravel it with his teeth, and would throw, um, with, you know, spread it out midair. As he would put his hand on the back of him and add chakra. As, a, as Sasuke would see a gigantic shark thing come out with a handle. As Naruto puts, um, we've all seen how Zabuza holds his sword on his back like that. With Naruto's Byakugan activated. As much as it's, hey Sasuke, you know one thing? If you beat me here, I hope you know, that means you would have beaten a Chunin. Sasuke says, what are you talking about? As Naruto puts down his, um, puts down his sword for a second, and then breaches in and grabs another scroll. He will unsteal a scroll, and out comes a vest. And Sasuke says, how did you get promoted and not me? Says, well, the Hokage knows the truth. Everyone said that you beat Garb, but the Hokage knows that I was the one. Especially because I was the only one who could summon the toads and that was in that area. People thought that Jiraiya had made you his summoner. Made you the next summoner of the toads, but no. Why should I care whether your sensei made me his summoner? Made me the summoner of his summoning jutsu. Well, Jiraiya is one of the legendary Sanin, along with my godmother, Tsunade. You think you're more powerful than me? Yes, Sasuke. That's exactly what I'm saying. You get on my nerves, Sasuke. That's not really what I was saying. But, let's get this fight going. It's Naruto puts on a shooting vest. As Sasuke then notices it, Naruto looks like someone he's seen before in pictures. Naruto looks like the fourth Okage, but he puts that to the back of his mind. As Sasuke, could, and now I'm going to go over why Sasuke thought this. Now, Sasuke would see the bands on Naruto's, both of Naruto's arm, on his jacket, in his jacket and arm sleeve. So yes, imagine Hinata's outfit. With the tuning vest, now, I'm going to eventually have the tuning vest a different color because I don't think that would go well with you know, this outfit, but yeah. Imagine that and all that. And I don't know what else. Minato with Minato's bands that be on his arms on there. So, as Naruto picks Sami Hamada up, it would disappear. Naruto says, I gotta thank Sonata for teaching me how to add chakra to my limbs. Sasuke would then begin to go through hand size as he activates his starring god. As Naruto is about to slice Sasuke, when Sakura runs out screaming, No! And Sasuke is about to hit Naruto with the Chidori. Due to him using his Sharingan, he could see where Naruto was, going, was at and, well, was able to counterattack by spinning there for him to stab him with the Chidori. And this is when Kakashi would come in and would grab Naruto's wrist that holds the sword and would grab Sasuke's wrist that has the Chidori and would throw them basically towards him. Um, 
towards the two water containers. I don't know what those things are called at all. But yes, towards there. As Naruto... Naruto's will be cleaved in half. It's she says. Samihara doesn't cut his shaves. And how does he have that sword? How could he cut that in half? As Kakashi um whips up his um his headband as he sees it, faint traces of chakra in Naruto's blade. Naruto imbued something harder with chakra so that he could have um, maximized his cutting efficiency. He sharpened his chakra. What did Jiraiya teach him while they were gone? <clears throat> as Sasuke sees this and begins to see, as Sasuke runs away, flipping off the off the de off the top of the hospital roof onto another roof and continues on home where Sasuke begins to pack and this is where we're going to be ending off well part of the what if the end this thing the what if and this is why I get into an announcement so there are two announcements actually now if you guys have not known I have been I had so I've recently joined a group called the Aristotle clan and well this is a group made up of Myro, Dank God, Bleach Unbound, Kosho, um you know right, let me reread the members of there's Bleach Unbound, Myro, Dank God, Kosho, me, Drip Kage, and Ralphie X. Now we have all become part of a group and the Aristotle Aristotle, Aristotle clan, and well, it's basically a what if, um, a clan full of what ifers. Oh yeah, there's also Zero, and other um other people. <clears throat> now, this is my announcement. This is an announcement saying that if you guys want um to hear some more of my what ifs, they will be on that channel. And I have other what ifs that'll be on that channel. I will be uploading twice a week on that channel. So you will get two um, parts of a what if on that channel. I've already started a what if there, and I'm going I'm most definitely going to complete it when I rewatch it and remember where I'm at. So <clears throat> yes. Anyways, moving on. Oh yeah, I know exactly where I'm at. Um, and that. So I'm moving on. This is where we come to the second announcement. Now, um, <clears throat> I will be doing something new. For the channel now, some of my what ifs will end off in part in part one of Naruto, like um, before he goes into Shippuden into the three month time three month three year time skip. <clears throat> so I will be giving you guys the choice. You guys, if you get like on every video, if you get give me at least t like ten comments or you know like well five comments or five likes, I will give you guys. A Shippuden version of the series that I'm doing, like through this one. I already have the thumbnail ready and made for the Shippuden version. So yes, there will be a movie for part one and a movie for for Shippuden of what if Hinata gave Naruto her Byakugan. And put once the both series end, they will be put into a bigger movie which has both series, both movies combined basically. So. I've come to tell you guys this. I will from now on every series I do where the Akatsuki isn't dealt with, or another villain that's supposed to be the final villain isn't dealt with. In part one of Naruto, there will be a Shippuden version, and you guys will choose by getting five likes or five comments on that video, one well on the series finale of that, not the movie but the series finale. So. <clears throat> Yes, as you guessed, part four will be the series finale of this series for part one of Naruto and part one of Naruto, what if Hinata, Naruto Shippuden, of what if Hinata game Naruto Byakugan will be up like a couple days later. So, I just want to tell you guys this, and so, I just want you guys to know what I will be doing with the channel from now on, and about the Aristotle. And there will be another video up on Aristotle Clan channel probably next week. Not this week, but next week. For what if Sasuke gave Naruto his starring on. Somewhat similar to this series, but yet yeah, somewhat different. So yeah, Sasuke was gonna die in that one too. Just just a quick spoiler. But I'll see you guys later. Peace and goodbye.